let's talk about contentment. Let's talk about being happy with where you are right now in your life and how if we're not content, life just doesn't seem to be what we want it to be. So I've been talking about this in these times of reflections, uh, being okay with the life that you live. And I want to just talk a little bit about being happy right where you are. You might not be where you thought you would be at this time in your life. Maybe you had expectations. Maybe you had goals that you wanted to reach by this time period. And you look around, you see everybody else seemingly living the life that you thought that you would be living. And it saddens you. And maybe you make you angry. But I challenge you to, to stop and really look at the life that you have and really figure out how to be content with the way it is right now. Because sometimes until you are satisfied with right where you are, things don't change. You know, when you're discontent, you search for happiness everywhere. You try and find it in outside things. And yet you never do. Because being content starts from the inside out. Being happy starts with you. It starts with me. It doesn't start with a job, money in the bank, a person. It starts with you. And so finding contentment with your life starts with you. We have to trust that God will be with you and is with you in your life and is giving you exactly what you need in this very moment. And I know that's hard. That's hard for me. And please know that I'm preaching to myself just like I'm, I'm sharing with you. I'm preaching to me, but I'm sharing with you. Because I come down harder on myself than I do with anybody else. And I've had to struggle to find contentment in my own life. I didn't think I would be where I am right now in my life. And yet I have to stop and trust God's plan and not my plan. And when I stop and look around, I see all the blessings that I have that I never thought I would have. And so I challenge you to do the same. When you find yourself unhappy with your life, when you look around and you think that everybody else got it together, First of all, we don't know what they have gone through to get to where they are. Find that contentment from within. Tell God you're not happy. Ask God to help you in that. And I truly believe that God will indeed do that. I want to close with a scripture from, from Paul. Philippians chapter 4, verses 12 and 13. Paul says, I know what it is to have little, and I know what it is to have plenty. In any and all circumstances, I have learned the secret of being well-fed and of going hungry, of having plenty and of being in need. My favorite scripture, one of them anyway, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. When you find yourself in that place, remind yourself, you're not where you used to be. And you maybe you're not where you want to be. But what you do have control of is where you are right now. And so trust God in the process. Be content with what you have, knowing that God will continue to provide for you as you continue to live your life. Thank you for listening. I hope that something I've said has blessed you in some way. And I catch you another time. Bye-bye.